Hi everyone, this is your math guru. In this video, I'm going to be proving one of the circle theorems that states that the angle subtended at the circumference by the diameter equals 90 degrees. Please don't forget to click on the like and subscribe button below for more easy to understand math concepts. So, if AOB is a diameter, I'm going to prove that angle ACB equals 90 degrees. Using the diagram given, I'm going to draw a line from O to C to cut the triangle ABC into two. Because O is the center of the circle, any line drawn from the center of the circle to the circumference is a radius. So line AO and line OC are equal. And because they are equal, that represents an isosceles triangle. So therefore, the base angle of an isosceles triangle are equal, and I'm going to label that X. Also, line OC and line OB are equal, that's the radius. So therefore, the base angles C and B are equal. I'm going to tag that Y. That's the base angle of an isosceles. I'm going to tag this angle O1 and O2, likewise C1 and C2. So stating what I've done so far, I drew line OC such that angle A equals angle C1 and also angle B is equal to angle C2. The reason being isosceles triangle. Therefore, in triangle AOC, angle O1 plus angle A plus angle C1 equals 180 degrees the reason being angle in a triangle therefore if i slot in the values i have angle o1 plus a which is x plus c1 which is also x equals 180 making o1 the subject of formula i have o1 plus 2x equals 180 therefore o1 equals 180 degrees minus 2x. I'm going to do the same for the other triangle BOC. So if I have in triangle BOC O2, that's angle O2, plus angle B, plus angle C2 equals 180 degrees. The reason being the sum of angles in a triangle. Slotting in the values, I have angle O2 plus angle B, which is now Y, plus angle C2, Y, equals 180 degrees. I'm going to make angle O2 my subject of formula. So therefore, angle O2 equals 180 degrees minus 2Y. Note that angle O1, I have O1 plus angle O2 equals 180 degrees. And the reason being that's a straight line. Angles on a straight line add up to 180. So using the values I have for O1 and O2, I'm going to have 180 minus 2x, that's the value of O1, plus 180 minus 2y, that's the value of angle O2. They must all be equal to 180 angles on a straight line. If I collect like terms, I have 360 degrees minus 2x minus 2y equals 180 degrees. I'm going to move my minus 2x and minus 2y to the other side. That's the right hand side and bring my 180. So therefore I have 360 
minus 180 degrees equals 2x plus 2y. 180 degrees equals, I'm factorizing, x plus y. Therefore, dividing both sides by 2, I have 90 degrees equals x plus y. Angle ACB equals x plus y. Therefore, angle ACB equals 90 degrees. Thanks for watching. Bye.